The first excellence in project management, projects $10 million or below finalist, is Reyes Construction, Inc. for the Repair Runway 321 Naval Air Station, Point Magoo. Reyes Construction, Inc. faced a seemingly impossible task and accomplished it when the contractor took on the Repair Runway 321 Naval Air Station project at Point Magoo. This design-build project primarily consisted of repairs to 1,250,000 square feet of pavement in the asphalt concrete section of Runway 321. This was accomplished by milling the upper 2.5 inches of existing pavement and replacing it with a variable thickness hot mix asphalt overlay. Additional work included replacing 15 electrical vaults and PCC pavement, cleaning and resealing 40,000 lineal feet of PCC pavement joints, reconstruction of asphalt shoulders, and more. To minimize the impact on missions that are supported at the Naval Base, the Naval Facilities Engineering Command scheduled the project for the slowest operational time of the year, the two-week winter holiday season between December 15th and January 1st. This extremely aggressive construction window during the holidays and what is typically the rainy season made an already complex project that much more difficult. Just days into the construction schedule, Reyes encountered issues while milling the existing asphalt pavement layer. The original plan was to mill two inches. However, due to existing subsurface conditions, an additional inch was now required. Coupled with rain delays, this additional work resulted in several lost days of production, placing tremendous stress on meeting the project completion date. Ultimately, Reyes worked tirelessly to finish the project on time, under budget, and with zero incidents. Owner's representative, Lieutenant J.G. Alex Ravinsky, may have summarized it best when he said, we fought against weather, the clock, unforeseen conditions, and just about anything the paving gods of the underworld could throw at us. And we prevailed. The next excellence in project management, projects $10 million or below finalist, is Shimmick Construction for the Shore Power System Construction Berths 30 and 32, Oakland. The Port of Oakland awarded Shimmick Construction Company, Inc. the $5.9 million Shore Power System Construction Berths 30 and 32 project. The project was designed to reduce emissions of docked container ships while in port. Shimmick's work entailed installing two new shore power substations, underground duct banks and vaults, under wharf raceway, and shore power outlet frames and receptacles. The contractor faced numerous challenges managing this highly complex project. Chief among them was maintaining a schedule that kept the project steadily moving forward. Because the main business of the port's maritime division is satisfying the tenants who operate the terminals and handle the container ships, construction work necessarily takes a back seat. To avoid impacting shipping operations, construction could only take place in the work windows when no ships were present. Approval to perform work had to come from both the port and the terminal operator. Finally, all workers must have transportation worker identification cards, and workers' names had to be submitted to the terminal weekly in order for them to gain clearance and access. Shimmick took a very proactive approach to the scheduling challenges. For starters, all the land work was broken into precise site-specific work plans for each discipline. Contractors worked continuously during each specific work window to maximize productivity. Shimmick performed careful detailed planning for the water work that included shipping traffic and tide information and created custom designed and built marine barges to access and perform the work. This solution offered both a safe and cost-effective approach and savings were ultimately transferred to the client. These and numerous other proactive measures allowed Shimmick to deliver the project ahead of schedule in December of 2013, on budget and with zero accidents or injuries. The last excellence in project management, projects $10 million or below finalist, is 
Swinnerton Builders for the Riverbank Elementary School Modernization, West Sacramento. Swinnerton Builders Sacramento took on an extremely difficult elementary school modernization that included the renovation of a 50-year-old school campus, a redesigned parking lot, the construction of a new kindergarten playground area, and an upgrade to the kitchen and auditorium areas. The Riverbank Elementary School modernization included a full makeover of 42 classrooms, upgrades to technology systems, a new fiber optic network, fire alarm systems, and a high-tech projection system. The project started during the school year, when students and staff were still in attendance. It was to be completed prior to the start of school in September of 2013. The original $8.1 million project pursued a highly accelerated schedule of just 10 weeks, while the modernization of the kitchen areas that was added later to the scope was completed after the new school year had started. Upgrades to the kitchen and auditorium lasted eight weeks and were also completed on time and on budget. Swinnerton had to complete a massive amount of work in order for the project to finish on schedule, and it wasn't limited to construction work. They had to formalize contracts with all subcontractors and make sure all submittals were complete and sent in quickly. The materials and manpower had to be scheduled so that no initial problems would occur. Work shifts had to be arranged around the student and staff schedules when school was still in session, requiring split shifts and Saturday work. Teamwork and cooperation were key drivers behind the success of this project. Swinnerton had several teams on site, each designated to handle a separate building. Every team worked with the architect and owner every day to make sure RFIs were answered quickly and cost and schedule impacts were rapidly communicated. That high level of teamwork between all parties ultimately allowed the project to be completed on time and on schedule.